All right, guys. Sir Jeremiah here again with another episode of FTP Academy. And we've got all kinds of stuff for you. So, first off, I was out wandering around. I'm going to have to screw this. We're changing the day, time to day. I was trying not to do that, but it went night on me just as I was. So, I was wandering around looking for flowers and found our stinking mystic white flower. Um, haven't made a lot of other accomplishments since then, but I've got a few things to show you, and then we'll we'll just we'll do some adventuring together probably. So finally, oh, looks like I didn't pick up this yellow one I got earlier, or this yellow one. I don't know why there's been a lag in pickup lately. Out of my way, sheep in my way. Okay, went back into here. There we go. So we're collecting every one of these. I don't have my pouch with me this time. I didn't expect to be doing a ton of stuff. But it turns out there's a lot of mystic flowers around here, so we're going to grab a bunch of them. The other thing I want to show you is we're going to do this next. Look, village. Finally found a village. So we have a village nearby. Oh, and there's a brown sheep. Good, because I want to show you something else, um, and I need a, a, a sheep to use for that, and the brown sheep will work perfectly. That's just a dandelion, isn't it? Yep. These look like they might be mysticals. Are those mysticals? Yep. This turned out to be a good spot. I just, I actually came this way looking for sheep. I was, I had been through a couple of, uh, a couple more flower forests looking for my mystical white flower and decided to go gather a few sheep to take a break and found my flower that I was looking for. So let's go do a bit more here and then we'll go take care of sheep and villages and other good things. Okay, I don't see anything else here. Okay, so we've got I've been collecting, oh crap, I'm full. <laughs> I've been collecting quite a bit of, uh, I don't know how I got all those dandelions. They must have been in the way. Um, but I've also found th these, there were some flowers up in the hills um, while I was chasing sheep around. Uh, they were kind of wilted looking, and when I break them, I get glowstone. So we've got glowstone dust. Um, so, good stuff going on. You can actually ditch that. Feathers and and eggs we can get at home. Anything else here? Just plain. There's no, there's a poppy there. Picked a little bit more aquamarine. You guys may be wondering why my chest plate isn't on. I'm going to show you. Go ahead and put it on. Let's go back and find this brown sheep we were looking at earlier. He was over this way somewhere. Whew. There he is. Because I still have no brown sheep, so this is perfect. So we take this. This is that other backpack I talked about that says you can pick mobs up. So you put it in your hand, you right click. And now, if you look, it has replaced my armor. And we are going to teleport. I've made more teleport points, so I can teleport right to the pens. Boom. Brings me right here in the middle of my pens. I can jump in here. And then I just put that back where it came from, and that drops the sheep. And so now we have several dark gray sheep, one black sheep and one brown one. I'm going to come out here later. I'll probably just use my bow and take out um, about half of the light gray and white. The dark grays, we've got you know, a bunch of those. We'll leave those alone. But um, I want to get this down to where we're... Ideally, I'd like to have three of each in there, but I don't think I'll ever whittle it down quite that far. But at least now we can get all the different colors of wool as desired. I do want to thin out the, especially the whites. Um, I want to get some more wool off of them and then thin them out. So I'll come out here and shear a few times first. Um, Joe, two thoughts. First of all, when I first built this, uh, you guys may remember they were all stone bottom like that. Because I just went down to the bottom and didn't think about it. Because it doesn't matter with the other mobs. But... For the sheep, it matters. I sheared my sheep the first time, and they were nothing but a bunch of naked sheep forever. I had to go in there with sheep in it and one by one dig out the, uh, mine out the blocks and replace them with dirt. But 
we did get it done. Anyway, the other thing I learned, I had to reset my my point here. When I set it up, I was standing right here and took my coordinates and made the waypoint, which is based upon where my head is. Well, apparently it does that based upon where the top of the entity is. When you are carrying a sheep, you are taller than that. Apparently, two blocks taller. Because when I teleported in, I was down inside the ground and suffocating. I nearly died when I brought that one in. It's the first one I teleported at this point, so I had to raise the waypoint. The other problem I ran into, the first time I teleported back, and the reason I decided to do the waypoint at the pens there, is I teleported back to here, which brings me, brings me to exactly this spot. And I came over the door. Door's easy enough. I stepped on this, it opened. But with the guy on my back, I couldn't open this. And while I'm standing here trying to figure that out, he had his head stuck in the wall and he died. So my first two sheep that I brought back both died. Um, which is why we only have one black sheep, because the first three sheep I brought back were all black, and the first two died. Um, so we, what we now have, we have teleport points. We have three of them in a row on this. That, so one on the roof up there, one here, and one down at the mine. They're teleport points, plus the teleport point out there at the pens. And I also moved our elevator so that our elevator lines are in line with our, so every time we come in, it'll be the same thing. So I can go up here, I can, I'm sorry, that's down. So I can go up here, I can drop down, and this just comes out behind everything. So I th just thought that would be a little more convenient for me. Um, let's see, what else? Oh, I am eventually going to put an elevator on up top. This is why I had to move it, actually. The whole reason I moved all of that is if we go up top, so let me just teleport up there the fields. So I needed this someplace. It was the original one was like would have been over here in the middle of all of this. It just it was just a mess. So I just moved it over here where it was in the clear. It works for everything. Um, so what else was I going to show you guys? Oh, it's inside. Boom. So I made more uh, drawers. <laughs> I actually only meant to make four, but I didn't didn't realize is when you make them, I think you make three at a time. Anyway, I end up with a crap load of drawers. So I've gone kind of happy with drawers. We've got a few that haven't been used yet. Some, one of them is actually full. Who is it? Oh, it's my andesite. So I've got two drawers of andesite now. I'm going to start expanding storage at some point. But to expand the storage, I need more iron. Um, iron is just hard to come by. Um, let's see, what else here? Did get this finished out, so we're all good on that. Uh, I do still want to use it, but um, here's the issue. I've not seen a single bit of lapis yet. So it may be that I cannot do my enchanting in this. They may have taken lapis away. I don't know. So there may be no such thing. Um, I have also started fishing. I brought, I talked about putting a permanent water source inside there for stuff I need later. Well, I can also fish that. Hold on. I sneeze rather violently, so it'd be better for all concerned if I do that uh, with the microphone turned off. All right, so anyway, another one. I can fish that. I'm just going to see if fishing will produce any enchanted books for us, any enchanted bows, that kind of thing, to get us by until we get Tinker's Construct taking care of all of that. Um, but I suspect we're not going to get much because I think Tinker's Construct is meant to replace that. Oh, this also reminds me. I need to replace my sapling. I have... Blossoming sapling. I want to see what it drops. So we're going to take out our... So we've got a bunch of red. Let's take the red one out. We'll put the blossoming one here. That's not how it's supposed to work, by the way. It's supposed to drop me... It's supposed to be able to take the tree out. Oh, got a sneak. It's supposed to take the tree out without taking out the dirt and sapling, or without taking the dirt and pot, but it doesn't work that way. But that's okay. Oh, can't plant that. Damn. I really wanted that to, to work. I wanted to see what this would drop for us. So we're going to plant this upstairs then. I'll put my autumnal sapling, sap, sapling, sapling back. Um, 
remember we got our uh, slime, slimy, uh, whatever that is, slimy grass and slime sapling. So I planted that in the bonsai tree, just went and planted on this thing since we're not using it for anything else. And look, it gives me more saplings, gives me leaves, gives me slime balls, and it gives me congealed slime. So I just take all of these and we've got a whole slime section over here. I need to make some more of these. Um, it gives me green blocks and blue slime balls. I don't know why that is, but whatever. I'm saving all of that. Um, I'm assuming there will be some green slime balls at some point, although I've not seen any. I did run into more slime dudes along the way, and um, they all... So I have gotten some new flowers. Cool. Um, oh, there was one more. Hang on. Someone's straggling over here. So what I'm thinking I'm going to end up doing is making a section of storage, not just a container, but a section of storage for each. So like for the Botanica, I'm thinking I actually want a drawer for each of these. So I'm thinking these these four by the two by two drawers, just a whole section of those for this stuff, um, because I'm going to keep coming in here looking for specific colors. And I have the petals and everything. So I'm thinking a whole a whole other section of these. Where I'm going to do that, I do not know, because I really do want to put in some. Uh, some windows at some point, and so I need to leave this wall alone. Uh, this was meant to be all Tinker's Construct, so I'm thinking this is going to be Tinker's Construct storage. I need to make some lanterns and hang them from the ceiling so I can free up this wall space. So maybe Botanica is just going to go right here. I don't know. We'll have to, we'll have to see. Um, I imagine at some point I'll do some rearranging. I could do some some library shelving kind of things. You know, put something along the wall, and then a couple blocks away, another row and backed up to that another row we'll, we'll we'll see i'll figure something out at some point uh probably do the same something similar with plants because i look at this this is all just stuff um i do like the sh holding shift on these because then i can see the names of things rather than just seeing the pictures so i can look and see you know where which one's coal which one's obsidian which one's basalt um, anyway, oh, it's all babbling. Let's see, what else do I want to do here? I don't think there's anything else I need to do. Oh, I need to drop this stuff off. Is that the mystical? It is mystical. Let's see, where are we going to store that? We're going to store our glowstone. We'll store the glowstone over here. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Oop. Put glowstone in there. And let's see, I have an aquamarine there. And drop off this food here. I can put my armor back on. We're going to put this over here. That's what this spot is for. For now, we'll put this sapling in with the other plants. I might just make a one chest for sap. I don't know. I've got to think about this. The drawers are cool. I really do like them, but maybe I pushing too far away from chest. Oh, I, by the way, I also looked and figured out that we can make copper chests. And copper chests are almost as good as iron chests. I don't, maybe they don't have the same upgrade path, I don't know. But I did make a couple of those just because we've got tons of copper and not a lot of iron. I mean, really, that's all the iron I have at this point. Um, no more iron ore over here or anything. In fact, we've got almost as much gold as we have iron. So, and we still got, you know, we got this whole stack of copper there, plus all these copper ingots. So we've got tons of copper by comparison. All right, why did, oh, I pushed the wrong button and took an aquamarine out instead of putting them in. We'll put our compass back. We don't need that right now. We're going to go look at the village. All right, let's sleep and then go back and visit the village. Should have gotten something to drink before I came to my computer for this. All right, so I'm going to go to this. And there's our village. 
some of these buildings look bigger than what I've seen before. I, again, I don't know if that's just luck of the draw or if there's a mod here or if this is just a better village. I don't know. Certainly growing more crops. Do you have anything here I don't own? Rice, coffee, flax, that's canola. Yep, I have all of this. Okay. Villager in a pink shirt. Okay. All right, so I guess we'll start on this end. I'm going to move kind of systematically. This is an empty house. Okay. There's no way to get into that house easily. I'm gonna, I'm gonna help them out. How do I? I just have wool. I have no. I'll help them out in a minute. This is an empty house. That. That. I don't think I've ever seen an empty building before. That's just waiting for a bunch of beds. Right, this one has something. What do we have over here? Oh, small storage crate. Whoa! Full of jams. I don't know what these jams do, but I'm taking them and the storage crate. So we have four different kinds of jam here. I'm out of coal. Because that spot up there is where my coal is supposed to be. I must have thrown it all in the furnace. Hmm. I have an actually additions book that I haven't looked at at all. So we'll uh, take a look at that. Yes, I stole your chest. Get over it, pal. Mine now. Stop closing the doors on my face. It's too late. I'm inside. Some wheat there. Potatoes. Okay. Oh, I haven't gotten any mushrooms yet. Let's grab these mushrooms. There's a lot of buildings here that's not been put to use. These guys need beds. Holy crap. So I guess I need to make some beds and bring them to this village. This village is sort of, where the hell's the opening to this building? Is this a, an unapproachable building? Um, all right, they have a building they can't get into. I'll need to build them an access. Holy cow. This. This is a poorly designed village. Get carrots, more wheat, more carrots. Some lily pads there. More potatoes. Still nothing I don't have. Okay. So I need to come back and help this village out. We're going to need to make some beds. If I can figure out how to get the hell up there again. We need some beds. We need, is it mystic? No, just the rocket. Okay. We need stairs. There was another place I saw they needed some stairs. Wasn't as bad as that one, but they still needed stairs there. Yeah, a lot of these buildings are actually not accessible. If I had a stack of cobble, I could get into them, but they can't. I'm going to use my piece of wool to get in here. See, if, where the hell is the. Oh, there. There we go. There's no door on it. Well, iron is scarce. We're taking the iron stuff. And you know what? Wood isn't scarce, but I'm taking your chest too. Mine. So consider this stuff payment for services yet to be rendered. I'm going to light this. Well, it's, there's. I'm going to light it anyway. Screw it. There's no door on this thing, so I'm going to light it inside. I I don't know if it's a 112 thing or, or just a, is this just weird? Um, the library. 
also inaccessible. Wow. I don't think I can make that jump. We're going to try. It would help if I sprinted. Made it. Not much in here. So I could have gotten bookshelves here if I wanted to. There's not a lectern, so this is not the librarian's spot. Okay. Ooh, it's going to turn night on me, isn't it? I will not let it turn nighttime with me. Crap. I'll let you out, dude. Don't worry. There you go. Wow. No doors on most of these. They're not lit. So yeah, I'm going to bring back a bunch of torches. I'm going to light the village for them. I feel like damn Christmas for these people. An engineer. He can produce black quartz ore. Is that all you got? Black quartz. Laser wrench. Hmm. If I had any emeralds, I'd consider whether buying something from you or not. But Cyan lamp. Crusher. He has stuff. A coffee maker. I won't steal that right now, but I'm not saying I never will. Let's go turn that lever off. Nope, that's just the lever for the lamp. Okay. I haven't seen a bed yet. Void crystal block. I can't get to it. Does this hurt? That's what I want to know. No, okay. Black quartz stairs, wood casings, small storage crate. Ooh, he's got wood casings and some void crystal. Okay. Iron casings. Oh, nice. So we're getting some good stuff here. I'm glad we found this village. Unfortunately, I can't get that void crystal block back for him. I know. Here's my wool. Let's do this piece of dirt here that I picked up. That'll drive it out. I'm stealing his void crystal block. He can have my dirt instead. Yeah, there's a whole kitchen here. There's a crusher there and canola press. Wow. I want to build all of that, actually. I don't want to, don't really want to steal it all. A fermenting barrel. It's in there. Refined canola oil. So that's something we're going to be doing somewhere along the way. Is his house. Oh, another empty one. So we need doors. 
beds, stairs galore, lots of torches. Move out of the way, dude. I'm trying try to see what's in, going on in here. Nothing, because that needs a bed as well. I'm going to take care of y'all, don't worry. Man, there's a lot to be done in this village. And so many empty huts. What is that? Beetroot. Mine now. There we go. One for me, one for you. in here it's another uh, this, this, I've already been in this one okay I think I've been in all of the houses not sure though that some of these houses don't even look like they're finished frankly all right so we've got some work to do for these guys we are coming back here I'm gonna leave that waypoint there um, in fact I'm just gonna move it 5, Might have reversed Z and Y there. Seventy is the Y, okay. Okay. So there's that. Um, what else was I? Oh, we want to try our slime sling too. I could slime sling back here. Let's do that. So let's port home. We'll drop some stuff off. Oh, I need, you know what? Let's go upstairs. So I think we can safely remove one of our rows of rice and plant our beetroots instead. We seem to be doing okay on paper now. We've got uh, all kinds of ways of getting paper. So I think. Make sure there's my beetroot seeds. They are. Here we go. How I end up with any corn seeds, I do not know. All right. Some rice there, just a spare egg. Keep ending up with the eggs. Do I have room for eggs in here? I've already got some in there. I'm going to drop that in. I really need to do something different with my food real soon. Um, this is filling up, and I don't know how much. Uh, some of that I'm sure I'll be using eventually. So, void crystal. Put that over here next to the aquamarine, I think. Void crystal block we'll put right beside it. So many dark blocks here. Iron casings. Um, hmm. See, we're starting to run out of space and run out of real, really any organization to this. What are those? Oh, those are wood casings. Okay, let's put our wood casings next to the iron casings. Small storage block. Just drop you there for now. Light gray wool. Should have a container for that already. Yep. Two. 
too. Yeah, see the lead looks like it does as well. Uh, probably lower durability is my guess for the lead, but it's holding up. So we're just going to throw this into our miscellaneous stuff bin for now. Jam. Huh. Um, put this in the I don't yet know what to do with it area. The blank patterns, I could put those in a drawer. Now that I think about it. They can go right here. There we go. Food. Drop that in. Why are these in the food? Those should be in the seeds. I've got so many of these. I'm assuming at some point I'll be able to compost these or do something else with them, so I'm loath to get rid of any of them yet, but I'm going to start doing drawers. Um, you can see I've got multiple stacks of more than one, and some of the others are going to get there if I start harvesting in any serious way. All right, got a spare chest. Let's just store that in here. Use chests in making so many things. That'll come in handy. All right. Picked up a spare pickaxe, that'll help out. Reduces our iron usage a bit. So, slime sling, slung boots. Put my regular boots in their place. So the first thing I, that's not what I wanted to do. First thing I need to do is figure out if I need to apply the feather falling or not. So we're going to go up top. Just jump off the roof. Okay, so no, we do not need anything. No durability loss, so we are good to go. So let's go sleep real quick. We are going to try to slime sling towards that village. Uh, let's, you know what? Let's grab a bunch of wool. We've got a crap ton of white wool. So we're just going to take a stack of white wool. How, much, how am I doing on wood? I've got plenty of wood here. Um, do I still have... I do. I can craft stuff there. I need stuff. What do I have for steps just sitting around? A few steps laying around. We can grab those. I do not have coal. Oh, I forgot to put these beetroots away. I don't have coal, so I can't light them very well, except I've got what I've got on me. That's not very many. See how much coal I've got. I don't have any coal over there. How much coal do I have up here? I've got a bit. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and take out a stack of coal. So we can light that place up a bit. I should probably take a stack of cobble with me. And a stack of dirt. Okay. I think that's good. Let's go see if we can slime sling there. The waypoints make this easy. I can see exactly where I'm going. Let's um, slime sling from up top. Should make it easier. Whoop, back up here. So we want to go that way. So we're going to go, I think this is about how this works. Oh, nice. Oh, water. How dare you? Well, I get some mystic flowers out of the deal at least. Just collecting all of the mystic flowers I find for right now. I have no idea how many of these I need, but we're getting them all. 
That way. Whoop. There we go. Big lag right there. Come from up here. That's a nice one there. Boom. Right into the village. Alrighty. So we're going to set up. I should have brought my... I, why didn't I bring my, my stuff on a stick? Dang it. You know what? Sliming, slime slinging was fun. Uh, no, just screw it. I was going to slime sling back and grab my crafting table on a stick, but we'll just live with it. Okay, so put this here. And take about half of those and turn them into those. We're going to make a few doors. we go. We need beds. That's the other thing we needed. Okay. What are you doing? There we go. That's good enough. Five beds is enough. For starters. So these things take up space. Okay. So Bed there, and light it. Put a light up front. Put a light up front. See, those both have doors, right? Yep. Okay. Bed there. And put a. Why won't you? Oh, because that's technically already occupied by that. We're going to go sleep before this causes any trouble. Is it not night? No, just a decrease in lighting. Okay. It's heading towards night. Gotta be night now. It's so dark here. No? Really, really looks like it's getting dark outside. Yeah, things are spawning. Why can't I sleep? Crap. Let's get out of here. are causing things to spawn. So why wouldn't it let me sleep, but it was dark enough? Is it bad weather? It's light here. Yeah, it says daytime. The hell that was all about. So let's find another open spot here. We'll make our way back Really? Zombies are out in the day. It's just overcast. Is that all it is? Guess it's just overcast enough for that to happen. Wow. So we're going to slime sling, I don't know, some other way. Go travel a bit and we'll go back when it we've had a chance for it to. I've got beds with me, so if we are out past dark, that's okay. 
we can make it not be past dark anymore. Good. Ah, oops, right into a wall. Right, right, right. Go high this time. Oh, not high enough. Wow. Sorry guys, didn't mean to land on you. What's killing them? Just sta standing there dying. So I could have tried to dig them out of there, but... You know, if you're not smart enough to not stand with your ass in the sand, in a block of sand, maybe you shouldn't make it. Yeah, I've hit the water again. Need a way out. There's a way out. This is the way to travel here, really. Let's uh, let's do this. We're gonna, gonna head that way, circle around, back to the village. Boing. By that time, oh, well, well, actually wasn't bad. Oh, aquamarine. Didn't make it. Didn't make it. That lag. Oh no, I still made it up and up. Okay. So where am I? Going across this way. No, oh, right down into a tree. There's no doubt this is a better way to travel. There is no doubt. I'm going to cut across a little bit further. Oh, almost had it. There was another shroom there. I'll grab some of these lily pads. I keep meaning to make a lily pad path somewhere. Never gotten around to doing that in any of them. There's a bunch of lily pads. Let's just go grab some and we'll make ourselves a path. It seemed more plentiful in this. Again, don't don't know if that's a one one two difference or if that's um, specific to this particular pet mod pack. Why why was that lit there? There's difference in lighting. What's the difference in lighting? Why is this bright and that's dim? Or is it just, is that what they did with the swamps? The swamps become dim? Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, right into a tree. Ah, another mushroom.
Too far. What the hell is that? Frog. Do I get anything if I kill a frog? Frog leg. Predictably. Get rid of a few things. That's something I wanted to do. Throw a few things out of here. I guess that's all I can throw out at this point. Oh, I see Guardian. I'm going to make a waypoint here. I don't want to mess with those guys right now, but that's interesting to know. So, we're going to drop a bed, have a quick snooze here. Let's see if we can find our way back to the village. We'll probably have to cross the water this time and hope there's nothing bad in the water other than those guys. Eight hundred blocks away. I'm going to start from up there, I think. So let's... Why is it just cancelling? Why won't you... head over this way maybe we can find something to launch from because swimming is swimming is slow and I sink I'm not wearing lead this time so again I wonder if that's a 112 114 difference or what because I'm used to being able to get to the surface in fact whatever level you're at you stay at Hey, where's the lag going? Thank you. It's four of them that time. All right. Oh, what did I hit? I don't know what I hit. We are at land, so I should be able to make the trip much faster now and without as much sinking. Of course, I still managed to find water. Right. Ah. Oh, 
not long enough. Let's go for that tip over that way. Boom. There we go. Just stuck, man. Just stuck. In fact, I am stuck. There we go. The legs are killing me. So there's the village. We should come over this way. We probably can make it across that way there. Wow. Monster jump. There we go. Boink. 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 Oh, I was going to try to bounce my way in, but that didn't work. All right. So starting with this house. Do you have any beds in here? Dude, you got no beds in here. You got mushrooms growing on the floor. Putting two beds in. I don't know what this house is supposed to be, but for now, it's got beds. What's with you and the doors, man? Now, you may ask why I'm rebuilding this. Duh, I don't know. I just, I like, I've fixed a couple of villages before. Um, in the past, it was mostly on, on multi-server. Actually, well, I think entirely on multi-server or multiplayer servers where some other player had gone in and just ransacked the village and I wanted to be able to use the village, so... Oh, I've left my table somewhere. It's the other end of the village. These guys need, some of these guys need doors too. Is this where I left my table? This is not where I left my table. Anybody seen a table around here? Table? Table? Anybody seen a table? There's my table. Make eight more beds because we got we can't make that many more beds. I'm just gonna leave that sitting there. We've got a lodge-like structure here somewhere, I recall. There's lots of room for beds. I think we'll just line them up in there. That's I've already been in that one. Is this the lodge? Yes. So we are going to line up some beds. I missed with that one. Switch. I'm lost again. Those of you who've been watching my channel for a while, you, you know that's not, there's nothing surprising about me being lost, even inside a village, even inside a village. I'm going to put this piece of dirt down somewhere. There. It belongs right there. We can carry one more bed. Just 
structure was I filling up? Damn vines in the way. I keep losing track of where I am. Okay, so I've done that one, and that's got a door. That one, no bed, okay? This one, I can't get into. There we go. Beds for lots of people. Oh, we need to light this place, don't we? Put one there, put one there, put one there, put one there. Should be plenty of light. Light the outside. Right there. Two beds for in here, and that one needs a door. Let's see what else we got here. The lag is causing it to. The lag is causing it to do odd things. There we go. Put that there. And these. Are these all have doors and beds and lit, right? Doors and beds and lit, okay. This was one of the ones you can't get into, I think. So we're gonna need some stairs up to that damn door there. Okay, so I need stairs for a week. Wow, it takes a lot of stairs. It's not the prettiest solution, but it by God works. Hey guys, you have a uh, place to, to live now. This is a big house. Throw a few beds in here too. Not where I meant to put those. That's where I meant to put those. All right, that's lit inside. Insignificant. Oh, I gotta get out of here. Get out of here. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Two. To run away. I'm trying to get away so I don't cause spawning in the village there. I have a, I have a 
bed here so I can just sleep real quick before he gets too close. So it looks like the commands Here's my there it is. Oh, right into a vine. Right into a vine. Boom. This is I just squished crops. I did not. Good. All right. So, got some light there, some light there. This will be a better village for my having visited. That gets that fixed. Oh, yeah, I did put enough beds in there. I think I have many more beds than they had before I was here. So, much, much better shape. I need to bring some food over here, too. See, this was another one that needed stairs. And I still have these are stone stairs here. This wasn't meant to have a bed, but it's going to have one anyway. The job blocks are missing in a lot of this stuff. So this is another one that needs stairs. Also not meant to have a bed. Oh, I'm out of beds. Kind of lost track of where I am now. Where's the entrance to that house? There's no entrance to this house that you can get to. Did he just walk through a door that I missed? Here I am trying to clear a path to do this damn thing. Did he just walk in and out a door? Are there... No. Oh, that's just the door to that side. So there's a door over here that nobody can get to. So you guys can get in and out of this house now. Who the hell designed this place? This needs a bed and a door. We don't have a bed with us, but we do have a door with us. Just 
distributing beds and doors like a really weird Santa Claus. This guy needs a bed too. Is there any beds in this damn town? I don't think I've seen any. What are you guys doing? There. There's a clear path though. It's not a clear path at all. It's clear. It looks like people are using that path. Oh, that's the uh, that's the back way. So I guess it'll have to do. I'm just gonna clear out. No, not that one. This one. I'm gonna clear a path through here. We're going to put a light right by your door, put a light over here, light on this side of your house, light there. So lighten the crap out of this place is what I'm saying. There will be no darkness around here. Next time I'm here, I want you guys to all have done more to keep this place free of zombies and skeletons, please. Because basically your whole home, your whole town, is kind of crap. Okay, so I think I know where I am now. Just checking these to see if any of them need doors or lighting or put some lights on the back and sides of this. Keep the spawns further away. Okay, we've got light out there. Dude. Not with the door already. Last two beds. Let's see, I think, if I recall correctly, this one needed a bed. Yep, this one needs a bed. Put a bed right there. A couple of small houses that needed beds too. Yep, that needs a bed. All right, well, that's all I'm doing for now, guys. You're on your own. Do better this time. Jesus. That was an awful village. All right, so we've made some... Uh, some progress here. Didn't do any achievements, but this this wasn't meant to be about achievements. I just wanted to have some fun with the slime sling, and we have done that. Oh, I have to grab my little table before I go. We're gonna slime sling back home and call it quits. up with more dirt than I started with. I need some space, so we're going to leave them with some new stairs that they don't need. There. New stairs. I guess that's good enough. What is that? Oh. 
if he's doing a headstand. Hmm. Okay, let's let's slime sling home from here. We're gonna take the direct route. Boom. Oh, into a trees. Into a trees. Oh, nice one. Oh, that was a good one. There we are. This is a quick way to travel. It's a little, little icky with the uh, slow loading, but still, very fun. Um, can we finish loading the chunk here that I'm in? Come on, computer, load up the chunk. <laughs> there we go. So very cool. Why is there an extra? That's odd. Take that with us. It's probably where I was stuck and trying to get out. All right, guys. So we are. Uh -huh. We are. Uh -huh. That's what we are. We are. What? Can I just go out here? Thanks. So we are. Uh, we are wrapped up for the day. I'm going to be making some more drawers. I've got to still go down and do some more mining, try to find more resources. Still don't have enough iron to do really anything. Um, the one thing I've got that I'm hoping for is when we get around to building a smeltery, I think we can throw iron stuff back in. So like the, the iron boots that I found, I think those could be thrown back in. So I think anything we've got that's iron, maybe it will be smelted back down. I'm going to look into our smeltery and see if that's something we can build soon. Um, obviously, we don't have much going on. I didn't clear either of the other two that I had left at the end of our last session, I've just been uh, grinding on stuff and doing some fixing up. But I'll pick out uh, five or six more progressions to go on next time, and I'll pick up with you guys there. Hey, if you've enjoyed this, catch, catch up with me. If you like people who can't talk, catch up with me live. Uh, Twitch.tv slash shirt. Sir. Wow. Just go to sir on Twitch.tv twitch.tv slash Sir Jeremiah. And uh, you can find me on, on YouTube as well. Guys, really appreciate you being here. Have a great day.